Hello, this is a presentation of Rabi Digital FPV system. We will have an overview of the hardware. We will compare the hardware with a similar system, Waxnail. And then we will do a teardown and see how the VRX, VRX it's made. Okay, so first a short overview of Rabi Digital system. Okay, so I started up the Rabi system. So what's Rabi basically? It's a digital system and the closest approximation it's similar with Waxnail. So we have a receiver that outputs HDMI to a display and we do have an air unit with a 14 on or 19 millimeter camera and basically that's all. I just powered the receiver powered the air unit and it paired automatically and then from you have a joystick on the VR axis and you can access all the menus and change the settings so let's uh, let's have an overview of the VRX okay so the VRX was made by a third party similar with Waxnail you can attach it to Google's course you have a power port you have a joystick for menu navigation a fan uh, some quick actions button buttons to be used in Rabi uh, an additional USB port if you want to add additional radio interfaces and a small mini HDMI output <coughs> it has four antennas two patch antennas and uh, two omnidirectional so basically it's a small form factor and the air unit I just bought it from open IPC website it, it comes pre-fleshed with Rabi so the only things I had to do is to solder the XT30 connector so that's pretty much the system now if we compare let's say the air unit with the wax nail one you can see it's similar in size of course it has a very big fan but probably you can use a smaller one other than that the small fact the form factor it's quite similar it also has dual antenna and a small camera so the main focus point of interest it's the VRX so as you can see it's a little bit larger than the Waxnail one that's to be expected so all this hardware the open IPC and Rabi hardware it's done by a small team of dedicated people so I would say the end result it's it's quite respectable more than respectable so we have a air unit that is just plug and play and we have a VRX module that it's also just plug and play so let's do a tear down and see what's inside this module so I, give, I got a screwdriver let's unscrew the antennas this one out of the way and we have few screws this is probably 3d printed I mean almost certain but anyway, it's, I, I'm quite surprised how small it is. Let's see what's inside. Just a cover, okay. So, this is the main stuff. 
So what we have a rad, rad, sub board. We have two 5 volts voltage regulators. I see a USB hub. Let's take this out. we have a USB hub and two small radio interfaces and a fan of course and here is a joystick so I'd say it's, it's a very well done job of course if somebody more dedicated can print a carry board a PCB carry board similar with cube pilot and mount all the cards to the same let's call it master PCB carry board probably you can get maybe not the same size as wax nail but something very similar anyway I would say as is now it's, it's very compact and very easy to use okay we'll do some more tests on it but overall I'm quite pleased with how it's made so that's all thank you